Welcome sa zip9.com uh, In this video, itutuloy natin yung ating series on quadratic equations and dito sa um, video na to, ito yun yung pangalawa sa ating application no? ng quadratic equation to work problems. So, gagamitin natin yung quadratic equation to solve a word problem. No? So, tignan natin itong problem na to. A rectangular flower garden with dimensions 3 meters by, 4 met or by 7 meters is surrounded by a walk of uniform width. If the area of the walk is 11 square meters, what is the width of the walk in meters? Okay, so, pwede tayo mag-label muna, no? So, sabi niya, ito yung garden, no? Uh, dinrowing ko na ng ahead para makatipid tayo sa oras, no? So, this is the garden. This is our garden. And then, sabi niya, yung, uh, yung itong part na to, yung uh, width natin is 3 meters, no? And yung length natin is 7 meters. So, ang area ng garden natin ay area of the garden is... 21 meters, or uh, sorry, 21 square meters. No? So, ang hinahanap natin is yung width ng walk. No? So, ito, from here to here, for example, or from here to here, gaano ba siya ka, ka haba or no, kalapad? No? So, ibig sabihin ang hinahanap natin tong part na to. So, tong part na to, yan. So, from here, and then from here, we have x, no? And also from here, up to here, we, have, we also have x. So, kung may x tayo dito, meron na tayong x dito, no? And, of course, this is 3. This is 3 meters. And also, this is x and this is x and also this is 7 7 so uh, aside from the area of the the garden we also if we include the walk no ang pinaka outside natin na length ay 7 plus 2x no so yung pinaka outside length natin ay 7 plus 2x and yung ating width ay 3 plus 2x. So yung area ng garden, uh, including the walk, is uh, 7 eight, length times width, di ba? So 7 plus 2x uh, times the quantity uh, 3 plus 2x. Yun yung malaking rectangle natin, no? But we only want the area of the walk kasi ang, ang given dito is area area of the walk, di ba? So, if we want to know the, the dimensions of the walk, we have to uh, subtract, no? Para malaman mo yung area ng walk pala is to uh, subtract the area of the garden from the area, yung malaking area. So, minus the area of the garden, which is 21 square meters, is equal to the area of the walk, which is 11 square meters. So, area of the big rectangle minus area of the small rectangle is equal to the area of the remaining parts dito. No? So, pag inalis ko to, yung part na to, ang matitira na lang yung walk na to, di ba? So, ito na yung equation natin. So, dapat uh, yung equation natin maging quadratic equation no, para uh, tayo ay makapag-solve at makuha natin yung value ng x. So, expanding, we have uh, 21. Multiplying binomials ito, no? So, dapat uh, maalala nyo. Uh, 21 plus 7 times 2x is 14x plus... We distribute 7, and then we also distribute 2x. Then 2x times 3 is 6x, and 2x times 2x, sorry, 
at that same color 2x times 2x is equal to 4x squared minus and then minus 21 equals 11 so we have uh, pwede na natin balik tarin na natin x squared no 4x squared plus this is 20x plus uh, 21 minus 21 equals 11 so magka-cancel na ito so ang natira sa equation natin we have uh, 4 4x squared plus 20x equals 11 so para siya maging ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0 diba ito yung pinaka general form natin plus bx plus c equals 0 dapat mag minus 11 tayo on both sides so 4x squared plus 20x minus 11 so 11 minus 11 magiging 0 siya okay so mukhang wala tayong mukhang mahirap siyang i-factor no so ang gagawin natin dito is gamit tayo ng uh, quadratic formula no so paano nga ulit yung quadratic formula we identify a b and c and then substitute doon sa quadratic formula natin so from here, ang a natin ay 4, a equals 4, and then b equals 20, and c is equals to negative 11. No? And then we substitute, diba, x equals, paano nga yung quadratic form, formula natin? We have uh, negative b, diba? So we have... Uh, negative b plus minus squared of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a no? so we have negative 20 we have negative 20 plus minus squared of b squared which is 400 minus 4 times a which is 4 and then times c which is negative 11 all over 2a which is 8 so mangyari is negative 20 plus minus squared of 400 minus ano 16 times 11 this becomes positive di ba kasi negative tsaka negative then 16 times 11 176 oh. 76. Dapat alamin yung shortcut yan. Multiplication by 11, di ba? Oh, sorry. This is already plus. No? And then we have uh, uh, over 8, no? So this becomes negative 20 plus minus square root of 576 over 8 which is equal to ano ba ang 576? 24 ata, no? So uh, this is equal to Obsession na kami yung aso namin We have um, Negative 20 plus minus 24 Over 8 So dalawa yan no? So mag we have uh, Equal to negative 20 Yung x sub 1 natin Dalawa yung root natin Ma minus muna natin Negative 20 minus 24 over 8 at saka yung x sub 2 natin we have negative 20 plus 24 over 8 so dito ang negative 20 minus 24 is negative 44 over 8 at yung isa naman ay 4 over 8 or 1 half so from here ang x natin ay hindi pwedeng maging negative. So, wala na to, no? Wala na tong x sub 1 na to. So, wala na siya. Bakit? Bakit? Kasi negative siya, di ba? Wala naman tayong, uh, ang pinag-uusapan natin dito ay uh, uh, positive dahil yun yung ating walk, no? Measure siya ng walk. So, ibig sabihin yung uh, doon sa diagram natin kanina, no? Ibig sabihin yung, yun yung measure ng walk ay 1 half no? 
one half. Sorry. Sabihin yung uh, width ng rook natin from here, for example, to here. No. This is one half. No? One half meters. No? Okay, so I hope pero kayo natunan dito sa um, uh, video na to and uh, gusto kayong invite sa zip9.com. No? Nakalimuto ko ilagay dito. No? But here we have zip9.com, yung ating blog. And of course, if you want to subscribe to sa YouTube channel natin, you can click the subscribe button below the video. Maraming salamat and see you in the next tutorial.